Welcome to Edupedia World. In this video, we will discuss mean deviation and coefficient of mean deviation. Mean deviation range, interquartile range, and quartile deviation suffer from a common defect that is, they are calculated by taking into account only two values of a series either the extreme values as in case of range or the values of the quartiles as in case of quartile deviation. So it is always better to have such a measure of dispersion which takes into account all the observations of a series and is calculated in relation to a central value. Mean deviation is such a measure of dispersion. Mean deviation is the arithmetic average of the deviations of all the values taken from some average value, mean, median, mode of the series, ignoring positive or negative signs of the deviations. Mean deviation is also known as first moment of dispersion. Mean deviation is based on all the items of the series. Theoretically, mean deviation can be calculated by taking deviations from any of the three averages. But in actual practice, mean deviation is calculated either from mean or from median. Mode is usually not considered as its value is indeterminate and it gives erroneous conclusion. Between mean and median, the latter is supposed to be better than the former because the sum of deviations from median is less than the sum of the deviations from mean. So if the choice is to be made between mean and median, median will be more appropriate. While calculating deviations from the selected average, the signs positive or negative of deviations are ignored and all the deviations are taken as positive. Now question arises why plus or minus sign is ignored. In algebraic signs are considered then the sum of deviations from the mean should be zero and from the median would be nearly zero in case of moderately asymmetrical series. So to study the variation of items from a central value plus and minus signs are ignored. Coefficient of mean deviation. It is a relative measure of dispersion. It is used to compare variation of two distribution expressed in different units. To calculate coefficient of mean deviation, mean deviation is divided by the average from which it has been calculated. Symbolically it is written, coefficient of mean deviation from mean is equals to md mean divided by mean where MD stands for mean deviation. Next, coefficient of mean deviation from median is equals to MDM divided by M. So this is how we will write coefficient of mean deviation from mean and median respectively. Calculation of mean deviation and its coefficient in individual series. In case of individual series, the mean deviation is calculated by totaling the deviations from the mean or median, ignoring plus or minus signs and dividing the total by the number of items. The following steps are observed to calculate mean deviation in individual series. First, calculate average mean or median from which mean deviation is to be calculated. Second step, 
we have to find out absolute deviation d that is positive value of deviation ignoring plus or minus signs third step we have to find out sum total of deviation that is sigma d and the last step mean deviation is calculated by dividing sum total of deviations by the number of items symbolically it is written mean deviation from mean that is md mean which is written sigma d divided by n where d is equals to x minus mean next formula mean deviation from median written as mdm which is equals to sigma d divided by n here d is equals to x minus m which means median coefficient of mean deviation is calculated by dividing mean deviation by the concerned average symbolically it is written cmd which is coefficient of mean deviation equals to md mean divided by x where md is mean deviation x with the bar above it is mean divided by mean next coefficient of mean deviation equals to md m divided by m where md is mean deviation m is median this is the formula of coefficient of mean deviation we will understand this with the help of a following illustration in the coming slide calculation of mean deviation and its coefficient in individual series in the following illustration we have to calculate mean deviation using arithmetic mean and we have to find out coefficient of mean deviation from the data 10 8 6 12 and 14 with the solution we will first arrange data in ascending order for that we will make a table of three column in the first column we will write serial number that is 1 2 3 4 and 5 when where n is equals to 5 in the second column we will write x which is in the ascending order 6 8 10 12 14 which comes sigma x is equals to 50 in the third column we will write d is equals to x minus mean mean we have calculated below the table you can see that mean is equals to sigma x by n sigma x is 50 and n is 5 50 divided by 5 we will get 10 as mean now we will calculate the values for the third column d is equals to x minus mean so x is 6 and mean is 10 6 minus 10 we will get minus 4 we have to ignore the positive and negative signs so we will write only 4 second 8 minus 10 we will get 2 10 minus 10 equals to 0 12 minus 10 equals to 2 and 14 minus 10 equals to 4 so sigma d is equals to 12 now we'll calculate mean deviation from mean that is md mean is equals to sigma d by n sigma d is 12 n is 5 so 12 divided by 5 we will get 2.4 as mean deviation from mean now next is coefficient of mean deviation that is cmd mean is equals to md mean divided by mean md we have calculated 2.4 and mean we have calculated 10 so 2.4 divided by 10 we will get 0.24 as coefficient of mean deviation this is how we will calculate mean deviation and its coefficient using arithmetic mean next we come to calculation of mean deviation and its coefficient in individual series using median let us understand this with the help of a following illustration we have to calculate mean deviation and its coefficient using median 
marks obtained by seven students are given to us. So let's start with the solution. First, we will arrange the data in ascending order. We will make the table of three column. In the first column, we will write serial number, that is from one to seven. In the second column, we will write marks, which is denoted by letter X in ascending order. Then we'll find out median, that is median is equals to size of N plus one by two item. So here N is seven. So seven plus one by two item is equals to size of fourth item. As you can see in the table, size of fourth item is 55. So in the third column, we'll write deviation, which is denoted by letter D is equals to X minus M. X is marks and M is median. So we will deduct 55 from 12, we will get 43. We will ignore negative or positive signs. So likewise, we will deduct 55 from 20, we will get 35. We will deduct 55 from 40, we will get 15 and so on. We will write the values. At the end, we will get sigma d is equals to 158. Now we will calculate mean deviation from median. That is MDM is equals to sigma D by N. Sigma D is 158 and N is 7. So we will divide 158 by 7. We will get 22.57. Next is coefficient of mean deviation. That is CMDM is equals to MDM by M. MDM is mean deviation of median which we have calculated earlier. That is 22.57. Divided by 55, we will get 0.41. This is how we will calculate mean deviation and its coefficient in individual series using median. Thank you for watching Edupedia World videos.